Okay, so this is my messy desk and I just cleaned everything yesterday, but um, I kind of had this inspiration to make these little prayer journals and I didn't put anything on the inside, I just decorated the covers because um, I'm not that good yet. But anyway, so these are both her friends and what I took is just your standard composition book. I actually got these at Second Chance thrift shop in Pacific Road a while ago and I took some scrapbook paper cut it to fit on the front the back on the inside some paper and then the and then I, I glued lace on top so the idea is that you can take this and tie it of course, now I've got sticky fingers. Well, I actually don't have sticky fingers, but I do have dry, uh, crazy glue on there. And contrary to popular belief, it does not glue your fingers together, but it does leave them sticky for a while. So you do that. And there you go. And then that's what you do with this one. There's the inside of that. Inside and then the outside page with lace. Oh, and I forgot I glued the, so I did the front cover, covered the back, put the fabric on the, the velvet ribbon on and then cut the lace to fit. So this is another one for another friend. And there you go. Now I'm going to have to clean all this mess up again, <laughs> but that's okay. The day's young. I can do that. And I think I, I thought I had the lace even, but maybe not, but that's okay. But anyway, that's, so that's the idea. And those are the two little prayer journals. And that's just my little, my little Sunday inspiration. I've got all this paper, all these bits of lace. This is really beautiful lace, by the way. You don't want tulle because tulle is too stiff. You want chiffon. And that's what this is. So I have a whole nother, I still have this whole piece left, which I'm not sure what I'll do with. I'll figure out something. So there you go. That's my, my two little prayer journals, both for two really sweet friends. And you can take any composition book. So um, I used this fabric fusion from Aileen. I also used crazy glue. Crazy glue might be better actually, uh, but you need a bigger tube because that wasn't big enough. I used a glue stick that I got at the grocery store, a pencil, a ruler from quilting, some scissors that are fabric cutting scissors. Um, I think that's pretty much it. And then a bunch of scrapbook paper. So there you go. But I hope you like them. Love and hugs. Bye.